All right, so this is what it takes to program your SNR radio using WinFlash. Um, so WinFlash, pretty easy to get a hold of. If you don't have it, I can put a link in the description. So I'm gonna launch it here. Um, so first thing we're gonna do is go and configure ports. So we're just gonna connect our radio here. So in here we can see we got serial port one, serial port two, our baud rate we want at 38,400, parity we want at none, but if you can see here in mode we got trim com only, and then mode we got GPS corrections. So we just need to open serial port one for GPS corrections, hit set. Says port configured, completed successfully, press menu. So we're gonna go back to the menu and now we wanna go to configure radio. We're gonna hit next, hit finish. It's gonna do its thing. So on here, I've got my radio, I've got my serial number, and then I just need to configure what channel I want it on. I'm gonna put this on channel 11. I'm gonna hit set. Sending configuration. Should pop up here in a second saying it's done. Oops, got my camera. So it says radio configuration completed successfully. So we're gonna go back to the menu. If for some reason you try to do this configure radio or configure ports and it just sits there and thinks and thinks, a lot of times what you gotta do is go in and reflash the firmware. I found is easiest way to get you going again. So you update, try to get to version 5.7 or 5.72 um, and should be good to go, but on these radios that are going on these Komatsu machines, they need to at least be at version 5.66. So, and once we're done there, we can just hit cancel and close it, and we can take our radio and put it in the machine.